What makes you cry? What brings a tear to your eyes and a lump to your throat? Is it when you see other people suffering? Do you feel their pain, imagining what it would be like to be in their situation? That's what compassion is. It comes from the Latin words cum, or with, and passio, or to suffer. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and Jesus was so compassionate that he cried over the city of Jerusalem when he drew near to it in the final weeks that led up to his suffering and death. He wasn't thinking about his own suffering, but of the suffering that Jerusalem would one day undergo. We read in the Gospel of Luke, chapter 19, verse 41, as Jesus drew near Jerusalem, he saw the city and wept over it, saying, If this day you only knew what makes for peace, but now it is hidden from your eyes. Today, there is a church across the Kidron Valley from the city of Jerusalem that marks the spot where tradition has it. Jesus looked upon the city and wept. When I was on a pilgrimage to the Holy Land, we stopped and prayed in that church, which has a window behind the altar from which you can see the city of Jerusalem. I couldn't help thinking that if Jesus were there again, he would weep once more over Jerusalem, a divided city, a tinderbox just waiting to blow up with violence. But you know, Jesus, if you think about it, Jesus was there with our little pilgrim group. He once said, wherever two or three gather in my name, there am I in their midst. And even more striking, we are the body of Christ. We are his eyes, as St. Teresa of Avila once wrote, and through us, he looks out on the world. May we always see with Jesus' eyes and be moved with compassion as he was.